Dave Laser. Somewhere in here. Oh crap, it won't budge. When you're working in the garage, sometimes you want a lighter beer with lower alcohol content so you can stay focused and still get a little bit of a buzz on. Uh, the world is not lacking for choice in that department. I mean, you have Bud Light, Miller Light, Yingling, and now you have New Belgium Day Blazer. Now, the sales pitch from New Belgium is that they're trying to go after the market of Bud Light, Miller Light, and Coors stated. The question then becomes, should they do that? I mean, New Belgium has been fine purveyors of such brews as Fat Tire and Ranger that are not offensive and good, and I, I don't know anyone who doesn't like these brews. But then it's like, why are you going after the casual drinker market, New Belgium? Should you be doing this? This tastes, to my, in my opinion, pretty much like Bud Light with just, just a tad bit of amber taste, if that makes any sense. Uh, and for that, I have to give it a, a one-star review, which is disappointing. So I had to give it to Josh to see if I was alone in this. We did a blind taste test to see if Josh could figure out which brew is Bud Light. And surprise, surprise, he could. I guess I would also give two stars, but I would give it a more solid two stars, if that makes any sense. Like, this earns its mediocrity. This is just passing mediocrity. He still gave it a two-star review on the normal scale, and I have to say, two-star would be great on the gas station scale, but for the regular scale, because it carries the name New Belgium, I have to give it a one. Also, funny story about buying this. I went into the store and, like, sometimes the six-pack wasn't tagged with the price for, for whatever reason. So the lady at the counter was like, oh, where'd you get it? And I'm like, okay, back here in this cooler. And, and she's like, okay, it's the import section. So, you know, the average, right, right around $9 a six pack. And I'm like, okay. Me being me, I didn't do my research before buying it. So I was screwed out of like $3 there. You know, sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Like this one time I got a six pack of Dale's Pale Ale for five bucks, which it's a deal anyway, you slice it. So, yeah, Day Blazer, not my favorite, not my favorite, but would it be a good compliment to a day in the garage? Sure. Get some, try it yourself. It might be your thing, it might not be. And there's my review of New Belgium Day Blazer. If you like this video, hit the like button. If you don't, hit the thumbs down. Subscribe for more and never miss an episode. Till next time, I'm Captain Wetbar.